My parents are Presbyterian, both of them, and I had to go to church and stuff like that. And then in school, I didn't, like, I did, like, um, what's it called again? The um, Scripture? Yeah, that's it, that's it, yeah, Scripture. Like, I did Scripture and stuff, but beyond that, there wasn't much. So as a kid, I was kind of like, oh, I... Oh, I don't like it. Like, I'll just kind of do it. And then as a teenager, I'm like, oh, I hate it. I'm an atheist. Because the way I saw it was like, oh, I'm really gay. The church is not really gay. In fact, they're kind of against it. So I was like, okay, the religion, you can go. Because it was like, as a teenager, I didn't know much about the church I was in because I never paid attention. I didn't really care about it. So I didn't know exactly what Presbyterianism meant. So I was like, oh, you know, I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to deal with that stuff because my understanding of Christianity was Catholicism, you know, confession and all that kind of junk. And then when I kind of like actually went, oh, I'm going to have a look at it, I'm going to have a read about it, that's when I realised, oh, that's not what this one is. Part of Presbyterianism, part of the main, one of the main doctrines of it is that your worship to God is between you and God. There's no priest or anything that has to stand between you and God and tell you what to do. So the way I saw it was like, oh, the church is just saying, you can do what you want with it. You can go be Christian how you want. So I, I interpreted it as like, well, I don't think I'm doing anything wrong. And if God created me, he created me like this. So like, fuck it. Like, <laughs> I love Jesus and I love men. Like... <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be in my tombstone.